So Google has finally officially rolled out Android 13 in stable stage yesterday night which was quite amazing and quite interesting by the way and I don't think so many of you guys were expecting this. We have the stable Android version here hands on with that. Let's take a look at some few of the noticeable changes which we found in Android 13 so far. The list is quite big and I'll talk about that later on. If you talk about the quick set, if you talk about this Easter egg which is available here, you need to move on to 13 which means 12, not it's 1 am kind of or 1 pm, whatever you want to talk about. Hold here and you will see a lot of things which look something interesting and if you saw my beta videos where I have shown you Android 13 beta 1, 2, 3, 4 etc. I shown you all these things so let's just talk about all these visual changes as soon as possible the first one as you just saw is android 13 easter egg which seems to be honestly speaking it does not look good at all my which is my preference but it's up to you another change another thing which you have in android 13 is whenever you install any app from the google play store or whenever you install app and open for the first time you'll see new permission manager you'll see this kind of new pop-up which will tell you which will ask you allow this app to send you notifications allow or don't allow this was not available in android 12 or android 12 l so this is something new a new addition in android 13 in the terms of privacy concerns yes they have improved a lot another change another new thing which is added in this android 13 is in the wallpapers and style now we have more wallpaper colors available in android 12 or android 12 l the wallpaper colors were not sufficient only three or four maybe if i'm not wrong but in this android 13 update with this android 13 update we have many options available many kind of colors options actually available here for you same like that if you take, talk about the wallpaper colors yes these are a lot and we also have uh, the basic colors options increased the basic colors were only four if i'm not wrong and in this with this new update we have approximately 16 colors available which was kind of expected as i just mentioned at the start that i made a video on android 13 beta updates too so things were available there too another noticeable change which we found here is in the system navigation gesture navigation if you're able to notice this pill size and standard pill size in AOSP rooms or pixel devices with Android 12 or Android 12 L was quite small and yes it's just my opinion this looks quite good as I'm a custom room user so in custom rooms I always increase the size of this pill and simply hide that keyboard space and Google finally rolled out this kind of thing which also looks like iOS style but yes this is what it is and it looks quite good it's just my opinion as expectedly another change we found here is in just my opinion this is one of the best ones we can simply copy any text from anywhere not actually anywhere but whenever you copy text from anywhere you'll be able to share that very easily and also you'll be able to edit that layout edit that copied text and with this kind of layout as you can see and the text which you have copied you can edit that and then you can simply share that whichever you want to this is something really interesting and it was not available in the previous updates i don't need to copy it once again as you can see the copy text is automatically edited whenever i tried this and as you can see from app name like from system ui or from the chrome which it was previously this looks good too another change another thing which we have which which we saw in android 13 update is scan any qr code which will let you scan any qr code and this available as a shortcut it's not android app available here of course it's available as an android app but it is not accessible you can access this from quick settings panel the thing is available you can simply click so kind of a shortcut available for you looks interesting might be useful for you too another noticeable change is in the media player quick settings media player has very new design compared to android 12 or android 12 l yes i'll make a comparison video very soon on android 12 l versus android 13 so stay tuned for that if you take a look at the media player progress bar this looks something really really different it was tried uh, like maybe in android 13 beta 1 that they will definitely change this thing and yes this is what they are doing and in my personal opinion this is something really different i think google love music a lot so yes they tried changing music music or media player a lot this is about this is all these changes visual changes which we found here in android 13 beta this is android 13 stable by the way yes we were looking for beta update honestly but yes we found this so these were some visual changes 
changes which we found in Android 13 stable version which just released now for Pixel devices and etc. And yes, I'll make a video on uh, on these changes, some upcoming changes, some many new changes which I was not able to tell you in this video. Stay tuned. I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.